It's hard to avoid, Jared. It's like a big thing that happened, and Jared's retweeting fan art of it, and I'm like, stop doing this, and he says, I can't, it's too good. I'm like, you know what? Fair enough. It's kind of like people retweeting art of like, have you seen Hunter Hunter? <laughs> yes. Like of the gone. Of the gone transformation. Yeah. Yes. Like, it's That's... hard to resist, but it's such a good Yeah, because it's, 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 yeah. Well, it's, it's such a moment. It's, <laughs> it's good storytelling. It's, yes, it's, it's, it's a very, very compelling moment. Yeah, it's not hype in the way that transformations usually aren't shown in. It's, yeah, you know, it's, yeah, yeah, it's, uh, it's, it's rough. Oh, man. I fucking, dude, I love Hunter Hunter. I, I do too, it's one of my favorite shows. <laughs> then, we'll all break into the lighthouse and sever the power flow to the battery. That way it'll hey, Al, who do you think my favorite Hunter Hunter girl is? Um, I want to see how well you're, you're able to, like, soul read me here. Pretty good, huh? Who your favorite Hunter Hunter girl is? Yeah. Is it not just Biscay? It's Bisky. Yeah, yeah, I figured. <laughs> it's Bisky. <laughs> it's Bisky. I'm a big, I'm a big Bisky fan. She's awesome though. That's fine. I love Bisky. Yeah. Everyone loves Bisky. Silent obliteration. Oh, that's good. That seems pretty good, actually. Yeah. 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 I like I like all the Honey Honeys though. Yeah, I, I do too. My favorite There's character a... in Hunter x Hunter is probably like Kill Yua. But yeah, he's a I good love, boy. I love all of them. Yes, I like all of them. I like I like the whole thing. I'm a I'm like a Greed Island diehard. Greed I'm, I'm, I'm here for all of it. I love Greed Island. I like that Greed Island gets to be like cute and fun. Yeah. I I. And, it, and it's also really silly still and. I think uh, Greed Island was placed pretty, like, perfect in the story. Like, yeah. like, like, people complain that, like, the bomber isn't a very interesting villain. Who he's, cares? And, and he's not. But no. I think he was the perfect villain for Gaunt at that point in the story. Yeah. Totally. No, I, I, I like, in I don't, no, that arc like, isn't really about its villain that much. No, in between, like, the Phantom Troop and... Chimera Ant. Fucking yeah. Chimera Ant, yes. Half the show. <laughs> over half the show. Like, I don't know. Like, I feel like... What are you, what are you on about? We need to shut me? down the lighthouse so we can hide inside and the battery. And not the battery. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Um. But yeah, I feel like, 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 York New is so heavy. And Chimera Ant is, like... Some of the heaviest stuff in like any shonen anime ever, I want to say. Mm -hmm. Um, having an arc that is just like a fun team building arc where you like get to feel closer to these characters and we introduce a bunch of fun characters and like I feel like it makes the following stuff more effective. It, and like it's also just really fun in its own right. It's like a they fun training dodgeball. arc. They play dodgeball and it's like the best shit of all time. Hisoka shows up naked without yeah. his makeup on, and Bisky's like, oh no, he's hot. Oh no. <laughs> we, we, and he is. Oh, he's so oh man, I love Hisoka. I do too. Oh man, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, Jared and I watched Hunter x Hunter, I want to say like a year and a half ago now, and we watched it all in like a couple weeks, I want to say. Really? Yeah, like we, we blazed through that show. Whoa! That's so my I just new sent that guy to the Shadow Realm. <laughs> That's my new silent obliteration. That's awesome. Holy shit. <laughs> so this level has a lot of like sub levels in it. It's, it's got, got a lot, lot of, of sub levels that are like platforming and like stealth. Yeah. Oh my god, that's such a funny animation. It's really good. It's pretty good. It seems a little faster too. Like it seems like it comes out faster. Oops, I fucked up. No, I'm just gonna murder this duck in the normal way. Oh, he's stuck. Zombie Zon is going off. He's always going off. He's always talking. Zombie Zon needs to shut his ass up. Zombie Zon is gay. <laughs> he's not. And... You ship him with the Contessa. I guess he That's true. Lie. Zombie Zon is. Oh, B-son. Bisexual. John Bison. 
Jean, Jean yeah. bisexual. <laughs> yeah, that's true. The bi in Bison stands for bisexual. <laughs> that's true. It's true. That's he froze himself on purpose. He's he's like, I know they'll be more accepting towards <laughs> bisexual people accepting. in in, in two thousand and two. This is great. And then he woke up and they're like, Is it good to be bisexual yet? And they're like, No. And they're like, eh, kinda, you guys just like don't talk. It's about like it. a little better, I don't know. <laughs> it's <laughs> this is pretty good. I'm choosing to believe this is canon. How do I get past this? I wonder if you could like hover over that. Oh, I can just Oh you jump. could just jump. Okay. You know what? I, the, the spirit of it was right. Yeah. <coughs> oh shit! Oh fuck! I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Oh, I'm in here. You are. In this weird. <laughs> All this was to remove the chair. <laughs> Sly, the only way to remove this chair from the door is to have you go through the laser maze. <laughs> Whoa. Not quite that simple, Murray. Murray, Murray, shut the you're fuck an up. Idiot. <laughs> Murray, you fucking idiot. <laughs> Bentley's still mad about that young Sheldon set. <laughs> shut the fuck up, Murray. <laughs> I'm molding, Murray. <laughs> He's a little guy, Murray, or Bentley. <laughs> Flip the switch at the top of the lighthouse. Too late. Oh, you like going down the lighthouse? Do you like going back up it, though? I love it. <laughs> you really do just go to the shadow realm. It's really funny. You just so fall like, into hell. I think I just, yeah. Get climbing, Sly. We can't keep this thing reversed forever. Sly, you fucking this idiot. Oh shit. Oh, okay. I see. I see. I see. No, I don't see. This is, the perspective here is really something. Oh. You want to go to the one to the bottom, right? Yeah, yeah, oh. yeah, yeah. There goes Sly. We're gonna start me. Okay, that's fine. Whoa. <laughs> I love it. I love that animation. What is he doing to them? He's sending them to hell. They're just falling through the ground. Like, I don't know. They're getting silently obliterated. <laughs> yeah. Maybe you want to time your jump like yeah, like when it like it looks like it zooms up. So when it when it zooms, you wanna Seems like you're kinda safe up there. Yeah, yeah see, look it's at a lot that. easier up here because because, yeah, you don't need, like, the bottom is kind of the part that's animating. This is yeah. a very strange perspective. It is. Oh, careful. Yep, this is this, <laughs> this right here. I'm glad that it made it, like, a button I had to press and not just... Yes. It. And I just walk into the ladder and you go. We did it! We did it! Slur. Slur. Doug really ruined that for us. He really did. Shout out to Doug. Shout out to Doug. Doug's a We're gotta be one of my favorite fellas. Ooh, if I'm heading back to the hideout, might as well take this. Oh, oh it's wait, you trapped. only have 40 seconds. What? Slur Cooper, hurry. Where's our hideout again? Right over there, okay. You should be fine. God, Sly Cooper's no, so no. cool. Nope. You no. know what? It didn't explode. Whatever. Whatever. Well, it's gone now. Yeah. I mean, like... But it didn't take you out with it. Yeah, I took it out. Whoa. Whoa. I love the glide. That's really nice to have. The glide is fun. Yeah, I think it's, like, it's way stronger in Sly 3 as well. Yeah. Well, the game's probably built around it, right? Yeah, you need to get it to progress through, like, the second world, I want to say, or third world. So, like, I, I think they make it better in general. Whoop. I love Powered Up Bentley. It's so funny. I fight with the power of science, Sly. <laughs> <laughs> it is really funny. I think that Bentley probably does, like, Neil deGrasse Tyson tweets. <laughs> yeah. 
The solar eclipse isn't that cool. You wouldn't it's not notice that it cool. if someone didn't point it out, Sly. <laughs> Wait, did Neil deGrasse Tyson say that? Yes, he, he got all angry because people were like, or you know, he's just doing the Neil deGrasse Tyson thing where he like wants attention. So like, the, was people were like, wow, it's a, it's the solar eclipse it's the, was cool. No, it was a lunar eclipse. To be fair, oh. it was the lamer version. But, but still. like, he's like, no one would notice if they didn't point out that there was a lunar eclipse. It's not that interesting. Oh! And and everyone's like, Neil deGrasse Tyson, you like shut the fuck up <laughs> for like a minute. Like it, no one cares. He's like, I cannot. Sorry. He's like, it's literally like, I am physically unable to do this. This is not an option for me. <laughs> Boat hack. Yeah. You can trust Murray's informant. That's the silo with the battery hidden inside. Murray's informant. Yeah, it's the guy that Murray beat. The guy that he varsity yeah. hard, yeah. By attaching a boat's grappling hook to the top of the silo. Oh, winch! Oh. Winch! Oh, yes! Oh, man, I missed the goddamn... I missed the winches, man. It's been a while. We any in Prague. Oh, yeah. Oh, the winch quote has been met. Finally. I feel like Sly 2... Or Sly 3 isn't very winch-centric. That's sad. Unfortunately. Maybe Sly 4 will be. Yeah, maybe. You should stay in position. I don't know, because I feel like Sly... Sly 4 probably, I think, doesn't understand Sly too good. So, like, I don't know if they understand how integral winches are to the <laughs> that, that was the real controversy. Yeah. Yeah. I won't throw you into the ocean, don't not... worry. <laughs> Wait, let me turn around, Murray. Whoa. Look at that. Look at that. Hacking! Is this hacking? Is this hacking? Yeah! Oh. Yeah, we love the hacking here. We love think it's it. really fun and not tedious. You can just skip all these enemies, can't you? What are these green ones? They're new. Just go into the thing. But there's a lot of green boys. Hello, green ghouls, buddy. Hello, green ghouls, buddy! Is that the best Always Sunny scene? Is that the funniest Always Sunny the, scene? The milkshake scene? Where they're setting up the, the Yeah, the dating, dating profile scene. It's is just pretty, like, it's got so much good it's stuff. It's pretty fucking funny. I'm always a big fan. She'll know what it means. <laughs> no, she'll know what it means. No one knows what people's, that means. <laughs> people's knees. <laughs> if you're going out there, cover them up. <laughs> so I'm a good. big fan of the scene where, um... Nice work, they, uh... Oh. Uh, pop an H on this box, so we know there are hornets in it. <laughs> I, I, really like, scene? I really like the scene where they're, uh, it's the, um, uh, it's the whole episode where they're doing the, uh, uh, the debate on, like, who wrecked the yeah. car or whatever. And uh -huh. yeah, Dennis yeah, is yeah. talking about how he, he eats cereal in the car. <laughs> they're like, no, this is, like, freaky as he's hell. Like, he's like... You're, you guys should head out for another you eat cereal picks up on what we're while driving. He's like, yes, it's not weird. <laughs> not weird? <laughs> I love it. It's sunny so I much. Too. It's so funny. It's like, so good. Where you put the bull? You put in the passenger seat. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, I, I, that's the I guess that's the reveal, isn't it? Yeah. That he's upset not because his car got damaged, but because he spilled milk on his front seat. <laughs> yeah. It's a good, it's a classic. Classic. So many good episodes. Damn. You just tried to snipe that bottle? <laughs> yeah, I was hoping. Right here. Oh, are we just gonna need to do this like three times now? Sure are. Can you put him on the thing way up there? Oh, oh yeah. N never mind. Too late, I already threw him. Who's your favorite Always Sunny side character? Um, does Cricket count as a side character? Yeah, I think, yeah. It's probably Cricket. I like Cricket I am a or, cricket um, fan. probably Cricket or, uh, uh, Gale the Snail. Gale the Snail's pretty good. Gale the Snail, very, a very seldom used side character. I also like the lawyer. The lawyer is really good. Yeah, I like the and, lawyer. And, like, who is it? It's, like, Charlie's uncle with the weird hands. Weird hands, the small hands, <laughs> the yeah. Small hands. Don't look at them! 
I like uh, I like Artemis. Artemis oh, is pretty yeah. good. Artemis. Artemis has sex Frank. with Frank outside the the outside the, the Wendy's. dumpster and outside Wendy's. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Pretty good. Pretty pretty oh good. Oh my god! Guy. One of my favorite the lines is when <laughs> they're sitting at the at the dinner table or whatever, yeah. or like the kitchen, and Gildas and Frank's like. Just talk about Gilda Snails giving him like a hand job under the table. He just sort of matched it. He just sort of matched it. I think so my favorite gross. always sunny episode is 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 the Birdlaw one. Oh, Birdlaw is amazing. The the McPoyle versus Ponderosa yeah, just yeah. feels like such a it's such a, a finale for these these like side characters. Yeah, it's absolutely. so good. Oh, I love it. <laughs> oh, fucking. They got Guillermo del Toro on to play the, like, yeah. patriarch of the uh, McPoyle family. What's his name? Boyle McPoyle or something. I don't remember. Pa I think they call him, like, Pappy McPoyle. Fucking it's so McPoyle. funny. Those are so gross. And the, the bird, Royal McPoyle, of course. Oh, iconic. yeah, Royal McPoyle. That, that's who I was thinking of, was the bird. Uh, the Royal bird, McPoyle. yes. I love Always Sunny. Shout out to Always Sunny. <laughs> oh, shout out to Always Sunny. If you have a stomach for shows that are sort of mean and uncomfortable and occasionally kind of problematic, you should watch that show. It's extremely it's very good. Very funny. It's very funny. See, part of the appeal of Always Sunny, though, is that it's a show about terrible characters, about terrible yes. people, right? But the show knows they're terrible people. Yeah. They are yeah. never rewarded for being terrible people. No, they are. Yeah, so I think the closest they get to like a wholesome moment in that show is probably the Christmas episode. Yeah. Oh, Throwing God. rocks at trains. Yeah, I love that. episode That's a cute too. moment. That episode's really good. You fuck my mom, Santa. You fuck Did my you mom? fuck my mom? <laughs> <laughs> oh, there he is. Whoa! It paid off. I was That's pretty what funny. To that guy. Guess he just. <laughs> Because he just wanted to remain frozen. Like, he's like, a fucking like, addicted fine. to it. Like, he's like, oh, I'm, I hate, I hate being free. I'm gonna it freeze myself what can again. I, what can he even fucking say, man? That's funny. Oh, man. This has been a very, like, media podcast-centric type session, hasn't it? We talked about Hunter x Hunter, we talked about Sailor Moon, we talked about <laughs> Always Sunny. Yu-Gi-Oh! Yu-Gi-Oh! Yeah, All sorts of crap. Stuff. We're just chatting. Sometimes it's just, there's sometimes no it's just like... There's no lot on the game right now. No, it's sort of like, slide, it's slide 2 has entered a holding pattern. Yeah. It's like, yeah, we're doing the... We're, we're setting up for the big heist. There have not been any insane plot revelations yet. Nah, not yet. They're coming though, I can feel them. Yeah. Yeah, and we're gonna finish the game today, so, right? So. We're gonna try so. to? Yeah. Yeah. I don't know how long pretty... this last world is. Uh, it's probably the same length as the rest. I think this one, we should be nearing the end of this one. I think this is like, there's one more mission after this in this world, and then like the big final mission. Yeah. So we might be cutting it a little close, like it might go a little late, but... That's fine. It's up to you if you want to like, cut it early. Yeah. We'll see. That's we'll fine see. too, we'll but... See how we're feeling. Yeah. I'm chilling though. I've got gas. Yeah, I got Not in like a gross way, but in like a I can keep going. <laughs> yeah, gonna like, be I honest, just, I'm a little gassy right now. A little gassy. No, I I I listen, I have my coffee, I'm like I'm pogging. I'm oh, hanging yeah. out. I haven't I haven't had a chance to hang out with Al in a while. It has been a minute. Um and yeah, like we've you know Al and I have listened, we've never had a chance to talk to each other about Sailor Moon or Always oh, Sunny before, so this is like a really important opportunity for me. I forgot I had bought a jetpack. You got so much <laughs> shit on these guys that you just have not like... Yeah. <laughs> had not like remembered to use. I totally... It's been I so was long. Like, I was like, I was like, what is that on... Is that like a... I was like, what is that? Is that his laptop or something? It's his fucking jetpack. Why is your ass so big, Bentley? Bentley, why is your butt so big, dude? Why are you? Why is your ass so fat, You're kinda Bentley? Thick, Bentley. Bentley's kind of. Th <laughs> I can't say it. <laughs> I can't bring myself to say it. Oh man, I'm close. 
But Moose is like, I hope I like that they're reusing this too. Like this is some this is from the Paris. Yeah, it is. This mechanic. We'll be all set to move in. All, all the set lag. to move in. Don't worry, Bentley, I'm on my I'm way. I'm on my way. I think we got a I'm on my way. Now. 